prepare to be lied to, manipulated, disappointed, all on the Flamingo YouTube channel. Ding! All right, maybe it's not that dramatic, but uh, Roblox just came out with their limited UGC update. Meaning, uh, if someone puts out a UGC item, they can make a limited quantity of it making it seem rare and special. So if you buy this sword, which no offense to whoever made this, and no offense to any UGC creator ever, except for you who put out this flamingo thing and then the day after we did it, it got infinite more sales than us. Sorry, I just saw that there and uh, my PTSD from it kicked in. This isn't, this video is not about me though. It's about the community. Only 1,000 of these katanas will be sold and they're almost sold out and they sell for a thousand Robux each, which is a lot. One month after they're all sold out, people can start reselling them. <laughs> Surely no one's gonna buy this for more than a thousand Robux. Like, people are gonna have to resell this probably for like 50 Robux. So traditionally, uh, Roblox uh, limited items were limited because Roblox would be the one controlling them. So there'd be kind of, uh, they would often put like really cool things as limited items and then they would actually resell for more because look, this thing right Right here this originally sold for like maybe 10,000 robux there's only 26 of them so it was actually rare you know ugc creators uh there's a million ugc creators now and they just kind of put out whatever trash they think uh people will buy which is okay that's uh, so okay but there's no like integrity to maintain a market of limited rare items pink troll face head 1000 okay uh what happens if someone buys a limited item and it just never sells out? Like, what if this just gets stuck at 600 and the 1,000 never sell out? Then you're just stuck with this thing. Golden Tiara, no offense to anybody. 1,200 Robux, 3,000 of these. It's almost sold out completely. I think the concept of limited UGC is gonna die out really quick. I think these are just selling out because the feature was just released. <gasps> Oh my god. <laughs> so, uh, 3.6 million. That's like a lot of money. What is this? What is this ad? Limited you. Click heart. This is for this? Are you really gonna trust an item that has this horrible of an ad? None of you are gonna make your money back. All 3,000 of you are gonna try to resell this in one month when you're allowed to for... 13 Robux. Only the finest gold and steel were used to make this unique tiara. No. <laughs> Coming to you from the reliable creator behind Crying Mask and Flushed Mask and Pork Pig is calling you at 3 a.m. Surely this will resell for a lot of money. Whoever bought this is gonna lose a lot of money. 5,000 Robux. This was the first UGC Limited, so by default, it was just gonna sell out. Forged out of pure gold. I like the descriptions of these. Try to, like, make it seem like this is actually not a trash item. Uh, again, no offense. Me saying something's trash than saying no offense so I don't get backlash. Yippee! Man, they're really advertising this. Look, like, F. This is the worst ad for the most generic item, but it's doing so well and has made this person thousands of dollars. Okay, to be fair, this person did uh, make UGC for Elton John and Carly Kloss events, but why can't you make an ad? Your ad is so horrible. It makes it look like a scam. Two baddies fur hat. Oh, this is from Roblox. <laughs> Okay, I thought this was like a furry thing. You know, I just made a video talking about how like UGC is a big pile of trash, but like in, in a good way where it's it's fun. It's hard to have a reliable market with limited items if there's just no integrity to the entire system. Like limited items is all kind of inspired from, uh, sh I guess, shoe culture and streetwear. Like if Supreme just started re-releasing uh, basically the same items over and over again, which I don't know, maybe they do that but people would lose trust in their brand and then they would stop buying from them because they know that they're being dishonest. Does that make sense? Where with UGC items, they, you don't have the same responsibility as a creator. And also you're just selling to kids mostly. Like this right here, this is actually a, like a controversial item. 5,000 Robux fish and 500 have sold. Like this is just a copy of this. Who, and they could just say it's a bucket, but this is just a copy of this, which became a limited item 
because it was sought after in a classic item. It's probably just gonna tank after this uh, gets sold out because it is gonna get sold out. You know, and because uh, people could just spam upload uh, any amount of UGC items they want, it does make uh, actual UGC limiteds a little bit pointless unless you're like a big name. Uh, let's look for some big names. Bad Boy is a reputable UGC creator. People will probably actually trust his limited items. Month of June, Michael. Who is Michael? <laughs> people are buying it. Man, for 4,500, so that's like 45 real life dollars. 500 people are gonna buy that. Um, and this this sucks, man. This is horrible. People are just gonna re, re again, people are gonna have to resell this for nothing. I'm so excited to make a follow up video in a month, just like the failures of all the initial limited items that just people were so quick to upload and then people were even quicker to, to buy because they thought that they were gonna make some money or something. This is nothing. This is just nothing. Oh, this is by Cutesy. Cutesy makes a lot of um odd things, I think. Oh yes, I remember Cutesy. Cutesy has been breaking boundaries for a while. I, I like this. <laughs> 8,000 Robux. That is basically 100 real life dollars that a thousand people just decided to uh, burn in a fire uh, because this is gonna sell out. People are gonna resell this in a month, 30 Robux. Actually, I wanna see how much money I lose. Don't buy these if you expect to make any money, by the way. Have a UGC idea? Yeah, clearly you need ideas. Oil barrel? You really dug deep into the, the left, left side of your brain, the creative part. UGC limited. 500 total, 5,000 for this, for this piece of trash. Oh my God. Also, the thing is because there's no integrity behind Roblox's system, if you see a UGC limited item that you like, don't worry, someone will recreate it for 50 Robux. The minimum amount of Robux it costs to sell something, they will recreate it for that and you will be saved. But for the purpose of this video, because I'm gonna do a follow-up video in a month because it takes one month to resell the things. I'm gonna make a UGC limited item of my bath water. I'm gonna make some limited items and maybe they, you might make money. You will make money off my UGC limited items. No, you'll probably lose money on mine as well, uh, but maybe less money just because I can market it. <laughs> I'm not against this, by the way. I'm just, uh, I'm just letting you know to be a little bit cautious because people will put these at these high prices because they know this is the only time that this kind of stuff will fly. Nobody will ever pay 5,000 Robux for any of this besides right now when it just came out. This person said too expensive, it doesn't fit. Yeah, what what is this supposed to fit? That's what the oil barrel is, just goes on your back? Oh, and of course, no. <laughs> I, I need to stop saying no offense because I people maybe need to be offended a little bit. This sucks, 8,000. Obviously it's not his fault. Or it's not their fault if um, people buy that, but you know what you're doing. Glowing gold cape. This is not glowing. This low key is, is a great item and I will buy it and I will make so much money off of it. If someone disables the comments on something, they don't want you to see something. That's generally what that means. If you ever see me disabling the comments on a video, I, I screwed up. That means I did something awful. I'm gonna buy this just to see if I get a refund. I think this guy uploaded this as a normal item like a couple weeks ago. Let me find it. <laughs> no, somebody else did. Yeah, upload a knockoff uh, version of the limited. Look, this was originally intended as a knockoff and I think it, I don't, did it get deleted? I don't know if it got deleted. And this is a really good example of why limiteds are really stupid as UGC items. Not everybody should be able to make a limited because they were selling this as 50 Robux, now it's 5,000 because it's blue. 500 people having something, that's actually a decent amount of people having it. It's gonna be hard to resell 500 of these in one month after all the hype of is, of UGC Limiteds is gone. In one month, nobody is gonna care about this because there's gonna be so many and it's gonna be so watered down that it's not gonna matter anymore. Here's something very interesting. A Roblox staff stated that following the rollout of the blah, 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 blah. Sorry, I should actually read it. So all existing off-sale Roblox created items will become limited. If this actually be, I will love that. Please, 
Please make that come true. I think that would mean something like everyone can buy a Tempest head. There's some off sale items that Roblox made years ago uh, that were really cool and I would I would like to have them. Will the new UGC limited items, will those clash with these? Like, could you trade a zillion UGC items for one of these? You know what I mean? Or are they in separate markets? Because it just says limited U and then it says limited U on the, uh, it says the same thing on this. I feel like they shouldn't mix. If they do, that is going to tank everything. And a lot of people who own these items will be mad. But if you still own a bunch of limited items from years ago, the signs have been there to just start selling all of these. I have a few limited items, but these are actually worth something because they make noise in game and they're really, really annoying. <laughs> so that chicken noise and the, the burp, then the harmonica they'll probably play in a sec. Like, <laughs> these were a mistake, but they're a really expensive. They're really expensive now, but I could just go into any game and annoy people. These are the only limited items that matter. <laughs> yeah, like I said, uh, fun. It's a fun update. Uh, I think a lot of kids will buy into it and then probably lose a lot of money and then freak out and be confused. But it'll be a good lesson to them to not trust anybody on this earth.